Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play The Thing. I'm Kamchak Visco. Come join me for the adventure where you never know who's really human. And this isn't even the boss of the game. I won't be able to hit you. Grenades will work. Alright. So hide behind the glass, and it won't break him. Well, he helped for a little bit. That didn't work! That didn't work at all! He, he just busted it, and then I had two problems. <laughs> Beneath the rupture is right here. Okay. I, um... <laughs> okay. Sure. Why not? I wish my crosshair would actually show their health, and maybe that's because I'm on hard? I don't know. The tutorials made this big deal about their health and how it all works based on the color of the crosshair. And the entire hard mode, there's been no color on the crosshair. This almost feels unfair. Oh, we didn't like that. Oh, that's what lets it out. I see. He must be in the red, because he's thrashing constantly now. Damn it. Shit, I'm getting torn up here. Escape. Escape where? Target spotted. Hey, launch, please. Good lord, there's all my med kits. Come on. Okay, here we go. Freaking hell. <laughs> I don't know what that was, but okay. Guess my friend bit it. Escape where? Where am I going? I have no idea where I'm going. Yeah, I, I had to anyway. Uh, obviously, if we hadn't, we would have had to fight our way out. So he would have followed us. Oh, like literally, where I came in the level. Okay, that, ma that makes more sense, I guess. Not really, we'll pretend. Hi. Um, I'd like to go before the ow. Before I burn to death, please. I'm gonna need my fire extinguisher. Shit. Oh boy. Really, game? What? I have no. Med kits. And, uh, how the hell am I supposed to do this? Now I'm like doing this whole stagger bullshit. What the hell is this? Except it may not be about how fast I can run, that's the problem. The explosions are happening at exactly the same interval every time. Has nothing to do with speed. Nothing to do with speed. 
So this may just be a, you're supposed to have health so you can survive this. It's like, that's kind of a really stupid way to do this, but, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. I have no health, I used it all during the boss fight. It just turns off the turrets. Nope, it's when I walk by. Not sooner, it's when I walk by. So I literally can't avoid a lot of these. You have to have med kits. I'm screwed. I could try again, but the way it's staggering me, I don't think I can. I think you're meant to have health here. Even that hit me, and it knocks me right into fire. I'm telling you, I think you're meant to have health for the sequence. Test save, but I'm pretty sure I'm screwed. No, I picked up every single one on the way in. That's the problem. I grabbed them all on the way down, so there's none on the way up. If I even to get licked by what? That was fair. That was a cheap one. Well, that's a... I can't fight. Are you kidding me? I don't have any health. And there's a big guy behind me coming up the stairs too. Shit. No, he's not up the stairs. He well, he is up the stairs. Oh dear. I hit you with a flame grenade. What the hell? That was a high explosive. I wasn't gonna survive that. That was um. That that was a bad time to use a high explosive grenade. That's what that was. Alright, I know the cheatsy fire is up ahead. Yeah. Here's where the cheatsy fire is. It hits you no matter what. And I hit the fucking flame. <laughs> There's no way to avoid it. You can't even juke out of the way. Now you'll blow up. Oh 
I hope that's enough, cause, uh, yeah. Not reload, come on! <laughs> No, don't come near me! Bullshit. Of course I did! I'm intelligent! <sighs> Why wouldn't I want it to be absolutely as worst case scenario possible? I don't want to hit a fresh save. I want to be committed to this because we have as little health as we do. I'm surprised it didn't burn me, honestly. This will lead up in here. Sadly, there won't be any med kits down below. Okay, that didn't hurt, thank goodness. I was worried about fall damage for a second. Now we have the key card. Now we should be able to use the stupid elevator. I no, I don't. Uh, did he hit me? What What exactly just happened there? I just kind of flopped off the side. That was jarring. I had to jump off the ledge. I didn't have a choice. I'm gonna have to try to hop onto the rooftop that's on fire and just hope I can extinguish it by the time I get down there. Yeah, I think he smacked me and I died instantly. I don't think it was the ledge. The ledge would have been me hitting the ground and then it would have killed me. Alright, I'm gonna save it here. Yeah, that's fall damage. I love our legs bend backwards. <laughs> so apparently hitting the ground so hard it'll kill you isn't enough. We gotta make it look horrible. Not what I intended, but I'll take it. They even start their animation and I'm dead. That's how little health I have. But I can hop off the side. That's all I needed to know. So I literally have to juke between the ones down below and the ones up above. I, need to... I think if I even touch them, I'm dead. Okay. Nice. Yeah, if they even touch me, I'm dead. Holy crap. I, I can't, because the second I get close enough for them to be able to actually react, they're already going to be heading up. Yeah, see, he's going to be right up my nose. That didn't work. I could back them up to the vent, but I don't know if I have the firepower to kill them. That's the problem. This is supposed to be a run sequence, but I don't have the health for it. It's going great. Let's hope that was enough to trigger his ass. It was. I have, like, no ammo. And they're all here. This is going to get real interesting. The taser is not gonna work. Everybody keeps suggesting that stupid idea and it's not worked once. And yes, I've done it multiple times, not intentionally. It's gonna take all of my ammo just to kill this one. And if he gets close to me, I'm dead. It's not gonna work. I can't fight them. I can't fight them. The little guys that spawn off are gonna kill me instantly. I have to get by them. There has to be a way. 
or I failed. It takes too long for them to catch fire. Well, the light's not going to do anything. It's not it hasn't affected them once yet. Just shows me where they are. For me to light them on fire, they have to be close enough. That's the problem. I I It has to do with the range of the flamethrower. There's a reason why I was ridiculously close to them. With the vent. It's not going to stop them. They don't recoil from fire. I'm telling you, this isn't winnable at this current state. I have to go back, play up to where I am, and try to do better. It's, I don't think I can beat this tonight. I think I literally have to prep this for next time. No, they only do it if you can lay into them with the flame, which I don't have the room for because they're going to hit me. So that's that's the problem. It's it's literally a... I've, I've, I've been doing this the whole game. I, I know how they react. That's why I'm screwed. There's no way to do it. I have to replay. I have to have health here. Because we didn't do the sequence. I might have shotgun. Let's see. Let's see if this works. I, I don't think it will, but we could try. There's too many. There's too many. I can stagger one or the other. I can't stagger both sides. Shit. If I can wait to drop off at the last second, I might be able to make him run around so it can work. Come on, get up, stupid. Of course, I don't know where this puts me. I'd be, I may be screwed on the next level. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't know where this even puts me as far as like supplies and stuff go. My personal thanks to each and every one of you for tuning in. You all are awesome viewers. Really appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. It means a lot to me, and I do hope you enjoy it. You all take care of yourselves. If you want to see more of me, come to the video on the list, or stay tuned for more. Feel free to leave a comment below, and please remember to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. In the meantime, fare thee well, everyone.